Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about what I order at Kava and some different options if you are bulking, if you're cutting, or if you're just wanting to eat some food. So let's get started. By the way, if you haven't already, make sure you like and subscribe. If you really enjoy my videos, I really would appreciate it. It kind of gives me an idea of what videos you guys like and what you don't. So ordered from Kava. Kava is an East Coast thing, but it has come to more of the South and some of the West Coast as well. So what I'm going to do on my screen is I'm going to put a screenshot of what I ordered. I ordered some of the Greek vinegar on the side. It is a little bit higher in fat. The traditional hummus has two grams of fat per serving and almost three carbs which is not that bad if you're getting one scoop. So that might almost be better to swap out instead of having some of the sauces that they have. Um, the second lowest, or one of the lower ones, is the roasted red pepper hummus, which has 0.8 grams of fat and three carbs, so not that much. The crazy feta is gonna be the one that has the higher amount. 6.5 grams of fat and 0.8 carbs. So if you're trying to go for a leaner bowl, I would go with the, the spreads. I would, what, what would you call this? The dips or the spreads. I would go with the dips or the spreads versus some of the sauces. Some of the sauces are fine to get. It's not that they're bad. It's just that they are a little bit higher in calories. So for example, the lemon herb sauce is six grams of fat, four carbs. Still not bad, but um, when you go to the Greek vinaigrette, See, this has 14 grams of fat in it, so I got it on the side, so I don't necessarily have to spread the whole thing out. But today, I'm low on fats, I've been busy running around working, so I need this for my fats. So if you're bulking and you have a hard time hitting your fats or whatever, even if you're not bulking, if you just have a hard time hitting your fats, sauces are your friend, but don't forget to log it in your uh, macros. Um, a good alternative for those of you who want a leaner, um, source of dressing. The yogurt dill is a good option. It has two grams of fat, one gram of carb, and two grams of protein. The garlic one is higher in fat, has 19 grams of fat, so I would avoid that if you are cutting and want lower fat. And the hot harissa vinaigrette. So any of the vinaigrettes are going to be higher in fat or the ones with the more of a cream based. So that one is seven grams of fat, one carb. Still not bad though. What I do like about Kava is it's very clean, everything is fresh, and most of the things you can, you're not breaking the bank for your, your macros. So I like getting the vegetables in it just because it gives me a little bit of greens, squash, cauliflower, and then Brussels sprouts. So I really, I really like that. Um, sometimes if you're wanting to completely get like, you're, you're cutting back on carbs or you're trying to reduce your carbs or you're keto, a good option would be getting the greens as a base versus the rice. So, or if you're like me and you prefer some of the sauces and stuff, just cut the rice if you don't like rice that much and get a, just the vegetables as a base and then just load up more on your, um, your other sides and stuff. So, like I said, this is a really good option if you're just, you're trying to find something to eat that's healthy. I get the harissa chicken and some of these sides. They have other sides as well. I like the pickled uh, pickled onions. It just gives it a little bit of a kick. A little bit of the sauce helps as well. And this is also dairy-free and gluten-free. So I particularly eat dairy-free and gluten-free, but I do plan on getting bowls that, or suggesting bowls that do have dairy and gluten in them. My, um, either I'll have a friend or my boyfriend or someone or a client or someone get a bowl and I can explain it to you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe, comment below if there's a dish or a company that you'd like me to try next. Other than that, I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great night. Okay, wait. Bye. Nice to, nice to know ya.